so guys we need to where is the my yeah there is this uh, we need to <laughs> solder our wires in this place so first of all we strip the wire from the top <coughs> like that I'm stripping the wire like that then there is a three point positive there is a output uh, voltage uh, data voltage another thing and there is a, the mid is positive wire and the right one is negative wire so <coughs> uh, we can deep power there is not necessary for deep uh, wire to the paste holding paste but and you can see I'm making a, there is the wire is perfectly soldered from the top and then we go like that and you can see the wire is soldered properly there is uh, another wire we use for that uh, data wire as a data wire so lovely and attach to the this place like that and making a perfect thing third one is a negative terminal I think this is uh, there it is negative terminal and you can Oh, sorry like that that's good so third one is soldered in this place this is a negative polarity of our 5 volt and be aware uh, the bit is too hot and aware to if this is touched to the so the things are perfectly connected our pulse sensor is perfectly connected to our so after that uh, we need to turn off the soldering iron So basically this is a li-fi uh, sensor so there is arduino oh no i am connecting uh, my arduino according to diagram so uh, this is the wire i think i need to So the this module is uh, already manufactured by the manufacturer, so we don't need uh, to make to the breadboard. So I think you have another, so you can uh, add your uh, thing like that. Uh, your uh, your um, NTC. So just imagine that this is a 10k basically this is a 1k ohm resistance so imagine that this is a 10k ohm resistance so you need to connect your uh, uh, so basically the breadboard this wire is connectedly uh, 
in this state so the positive wires uh, connecting to the from in this space so we need to add our resistance and just imagine that this is uh, this is your two point of uh, your NTC thermal resistance uh, temperature sensor so you need to connect like that I think you can see properly so this is it so basically this one thing is connected to negative point and uh, I'm just get we connect uh, this wire to the positive wire like uh, to the diagram you can see the diagram in this case I'm just trying to show that this is the basic diagram this so the basic diagram our we can touch our uh, this is our NTC and we connect to the uh, there is a resistance and there is a negative wire which is connected to it. So we need to this is our positive wire coming from the ordinium and uh, this is our data pin. So we need to attach our thing back to the video. So there is a three wires. Uh, the one is going to ground like that I think I need to uh, sorry for the inconvenient and this is our ground wire and we connect to this uh, we can power up our Arduino uh, this is not necessary to make your Arduino power on this is our data pin and according to diagram we connected to the a1 pin and this is a 5 volt so we need to connect uh, to the 5 volt let's see and you can see our uh, our pulse sensor is going on and working properly if when the and we upload the software so in the in the case of NTC NTC is samely connected to like that I have another so this is our positive pin I have some issue because I have no more uh, pins so I am using old wires you, in your case you can use uh, perfectly so this is our negative point and I connect it to this and I think uh, this is not on so so we can connect your NTC uh, like that and then the data pin is midpoint so it's just a demonstration for that I have uh, this module of NTC so this is difficult to uh, uh, show to the video after that uh, you need to uh, add your LDR sensor like that uh, there is a 1k resistance and the, uh, the LDR sensor this is our uh, this is our positive point this is our uh, in a mid this is our data pin and this is our uh, negative point and same case in the sender the LED pin there is a different breadboard so we can make this and this is our LED resistance so we can can connect because uh, we, our our Arduino connect to the LED 
so first of all we need to complete our first sketch so as usual we can see and uh, we need two wires but I have no wires in this time so you can connect a uh, data pin data pin onto this place and this is our ground pin after connecting that uh, you upload the code to your Arduino and then it's work properly so tomorrow I will send the second video to how to receive the data from the uh, from the LDR sensor see you bye